I'm right in the thick of it now, though. I'm right in the thick of it. I'm all of it all now. Good job. Insulated inside. Nah, not quite. I'm doing that. Okay, we'll call this meeting up to the New Brunswick Parking Authority of Water. Please be advised that the notice requirements of the Open Public Meetings Act have been complied with and satisfied and that the annual notice which gave sufficient notice of the time, place, and conduct of all public meetings of the New Brunswick Parking Authority has been filed with the City Clerk, has been placed on an appropriate bulletin board in the lobby of City Hall in New Brunswick, New Jersey, and has been transmitted to the official newspaper for the City of New Brunswick namely the Home News in June, as per the annual notice provided in a resolution adopted by this governing body on December 29, 1975. <coughs> See, everybody's had an opportunity to uh, take a look at the February regular board minutes. And we have uh, additions, corrections, submissions. Make a motion. And make, get a motion. Thank you. And a second. Okay. All in favor to accept. Aye. Aye. Thank you. Okay. All right. So thank you. Yeah, I have a few items. Uh, first thing is that the elevator modernization uh, <coughs> project is going to begin at the Lower Church Street deck beginning on Monday, March 31st. It should take about six to eight weeks to basically uh, put in a new elevator there. Uh, that's the original elevator going back to 1988. And um, basically keeping everything the same. In the meantime, we put up signage alerting uh, patrons that the, the elevator will be out of service for that first six to eight weeks. We're also going to offer a shuttle system for people who may have to park at a higher, a higher, you know, a higher level of the garage. Therefore, if they need assistance to get down to the uh, ground level, we'll have uh, security shuttle them back and forth. Uh, second thing is just let the board uh, know that open side street parking goes back into effect April 1st. Uh, in the meantime, the last week or so, we've been giving out warnings, basically just advising residents uh, that they need to move their cars based on the signs that appears on the street, based on the days and hours that they requested. Uh, so come April 1st, we'll the street sweepers begin sweeping the streets on a regular basis. Uh, as far as just to give an update on the fresh grocer, uh, part of the negotiation that we've been in was that we thought it might be a better idea if they uh, close the cafe, uh, which they have except for Monday. Um, this is enough to help the feet for the burden of the rental payment. About 1,770 square feet. Uh, in the meantime, we are working with a new tenant to fill that space. So hopefully, not the empty for that. Uh, and 
finally, the city of Linden is looking to start a parking authority, and they're chosen the New Brunswick Parking Authority to come visit this place to get an idea of what's involved, uh, looking at facilities, enforcement uh, procedures, and uh, all of them. So, this is a good idea of the site.
both parties, including Fresh Grocer, who is not paying rent, but also made an investment nonetheless, you know, those are subjects of negotiation. You know, uh, and it's not like having a 1,000 square foot bagel store. You, know, you can deal with that pretty easily. You know, when you're dealing with a building that was, uh, you know, built and constructed for a specific use, and, they, and a significant use at that, uh, there's a lot of negotiation, and that doesn't occur in, in public session, as you, as you and, and so I guess just uh, the update was helpful, but so there's still two ways it could go. It could still be that they would, would somehow be forced out or would stop being there, or it might be worked out where they remain a tenant under yes. new arrangements. Yes. yes. Um, Those are the two scenarios. That's correct. Okay. And is there uh, any scheduled hearings on this matters in court? I mean, how, how does the lit litigation process work for this? Well, there, there's been no litigation filed at, at this point. So it's still a negotiation process. If we're not able to resolve this, then the litigation can occur. Okay. And I guess the final question would just be if I could hear from the board about their uh, level of confidence in the Fresh Grocer Company and whether it's not their that okay. um, yeah, That's all I have. Thank you. Okay. Oh, got you, Any other uh, board discussion? Topics people want to bring up. Uh, we're going to move on to the resolutions. We have a payment resolution for this month. We have a chance to see it. Can I get a motion to accept the payment resolution? Make a motion. A second. Okay. All in favor? Aye. All right. Uh, Mitch, number two. I'll explain uh, that. Number two is uh, back in the, I guess, early 90s, there was a resolution put forward to the uh, state health benefits program. The state of New Jersey, they're recognizing that uh, 24 hours per week, uh, if an employee works at least 24 hours per week, they would be recognized as a full-time employee. This this resolution changes that to a 35-hour week <coughs> to be recognized as a full-time uh, employee. Uh, I will say this: that this change does not affect anybody at this point. We don't have a 24-hour uh, employees. Right. So this is just to get get this on the books. I don't I don't know, I don't know I can just speak of the company. I don't know if the twenty four hour is uh effective any longer anyway with changes that have occurred in the last four or five years with the with the revisions. I don't think I don't think you can receive health benefits at twenty four hours any longer. No, actually it's uh as of June first, twenty ten, it cannot be less than twenty five hours. Right. So, uh, Thank you. Anybody have any questions for, for Mitch? If not, can I get a motion for that? Make a motion. And I'll second. I'll second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. All business? Uh, just the car sharing. Uh, still working with uh, with Enterprise regarding the marketing uh, program that's being rolled out. So right now we're looking at a, right now the latest we're looking at is May 1st. Uh, Start date for the car share program. That's the way. Okay. How is the new uh, revenue share, the revenue system working out at Lower Church? Very good. Okay. Very good. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Any new business anybody has? No. Can I just, uh, no. just real quick to add to the Lower Church? We, we, we put up the Lower Church is the first uh, facility that we use credit card in and credit card out. So you dip the credit card when you enter the facility, you don't get a ticket, and then you dip it on the way out using the same credit card. Mm -hmm. So we actually have signs up now showing what's the fast, what's the fast way to pay, which is taking your ticket, going to the pay on foot machine, and pay off the machine, and bring your ticket to the exit, and the gate will rise. Um, uh. Faster is using the credit card Pulling a ticket then on exit using a credit card at the exit gate to take the credit card and pay what is the amount due. And then the fastest is dipping the credit card in the entry and then dipping on exit. So we uh, signs out um, I have a question. Uh, it concerns uh, what to do in case there's a lot of ticket. I mean, uh, I 
I had an unfortunate incident. Uh, I, uh, maybe a couple of weeks ago in which I, uh, lost a ticket and, uh, was, uh, wasn't really sure what to do because the machine wouldn't respond. Was the president to come? Yeah. Yeah. You pressed the intercom and no one responded? Well, I pressed the machine, and well, the lost ticket button and didn't do anything. No, lost ticket buttons don't work. Mm -hmm. You have to, there's an intercom you have to press, and then security would come, and they'd give you a, a, a what they call a deferred payment slip, and that's for the lost ticket fee. It's a special fee for that. Mm -hmm. yeah. But if you pay that, and then in the meantime, you find your ticket, we'll refund the difference. Oh, okay. Uh, that was a few weeks ago. Uh, okay, thank you. Yeah. Okay, can I get a motion to go into closed session? I'll make a motion. Second. I'll second. All in favor?